Can you explain time as a dimension? Well, time is one of the other great mysteries of physics. We don't really know what it is. We, I mean, in the in the theory of general relativity, we take time as the fourth dimension. So we see the world as something that is three-dimensional in nature, length, breadth, and height, the three dimensions of, of space. And this theory, the general theory of relativity, considers time to be the fourth dimension. So that is how relativity looks at time as the fourth dimension. But we do not understand the nature of time. We don't know what it is. It's one of the great mysteries. Is time an emergent phenomenon? Is it something that emerges from the nature of space-time and the nature of the universe? Or is it something that is inherent to the, un to the universe? We don't know that. Could time be continuous? Could it be discontinuous? Is time quantum in nature? Do we have atoms and molecules of time? <laughs> So these are open questions and we don't have the least idea of what time is. We have a very vague understanding of time. We don't even have a proper definition of time. It could be something that may possibly emerge out of the, uh, the second law of thermodynamics. It may be related to the quantity that is called entropy, which is a measure of disorder. It could possibly be a manifestation of the decoherence that happens at the quantum level and so on. So there are many theories. None of these theories has been proven. So time is one of the great open mysteries of nature and in physics. So imagine that. We don't even know what time is. 